I see you still believe following this path is the right choice. When will you learn that it's nothing but foolishness? I go as I am led by the Lord. Nothing but trouble. Nothing but hardship and pain. The side roads are so much easier, so much more comfortable. I can show you the way to them. I have followed your suggestions for much of my life and have gained nothing but what this world offers. None of it has lasted. Yes, but there is so much more to be offered yet, so much more. Why will you not be content with its pleasures, with the happiness that comes from all it can bring into your life? The way you have chosen brings nothing but constant burdens and frustrations. Here you sit again, destitute of even the most basic necessities. I wait on the Almighty to direct my path. You look tired, and your fire is burning low. Nothing left but embers. Tell you what. How about a nice thunderstorm to quench it for you? Rest well. We will meet again. Thanks, Father, for your mercies towards me, for the blessings of your provisions, the strength and guidance that you give to me each day. Help me to continue to glorify your name, to walk in a way that is worthy of you, to offer you the praise and glory you deserve. Help me to... Hey there, handsome. Where are you going? I follow the path. Well, that doesn't sound too difficult. Lots of fellas that come by here follow the path. Much easier than tromping through the forest. Looks like you're traveling kind of light there, not even a pack or pouch. And I don't see a single weapon either. Everything I need will be provided for me along the way. Well, speaking of things you need, you look like you could use a little break. How about coming inside and resting those weary bones of yours? I can make everything all better. So, you didn't care for the attractive young woman back there. I must say, in a strange sort of way, I am impressed. Many have fallen to her charms. Oh my, are they...
are those tears I see upon you face. You must be reminiscing about your lost family and friends, the destruction of your home, and all that lived there. What I'm thinking about is no concern of yours. Oh, but it is. I've made it my life's work, or should I say, your life's work, to know everything there is to know about you. And I must admit, it's been quite an interesting one. More so than many others. From a brute beast, a vile man, a drunkard, a murderer in fact, to one who now serves the Almighty. It was a shame to lose you to him, but I believe I can help you regret your decision. In fact, I'm going to make sure of that. I fear God, not you. I don't need you to fear me, but you will come to hate me. Of that, you can rest assured. I understand that your wife is with the Almighty now, but your son never put his trust in him. I will say hello to him for you when I see him. Perhaps I will teach him new ways to scream. By the way, I wouldn't drink any of that water if I were you. here, don't you think? Maybe it's time to cool you off for a while. Too bad you didn't bring a coat along. Nice to be out of the cold, isn't it? In your case, though, it's more like out of the frying pan and into the fire. You'll never experience those fires below, but I can at least give you a small taste of them. Listen. Did you hear that? 
Is that your son screaming far below us? That's it. That's what I want to see. A little anger, some indignation at my poor attempts to reveal to you that part within yourself that still hates, still wants vengeance, still wants to be in control. He preserveth the souls of his saints. He delivereth them out of the hand of the wicked. Oh, it's not my hands you need to be worried about. Seems as if someone still has your back. The Lord God is my strength, and he will make my feet like hinds feet. Perhaps so, but I don't think I'm quite finished with you yet. There's so much more I think you need to learn. So many more cruelties I believe you need to experience. If my father in heaven had allowed you to kill me, you would have done so by now. You have nothing but deceptions and attempted diversions, trying to take me off the path that you yourself cannot follow. Thou couldst have no power at all against me, except it were given thee from above. And I think your time with me is completed. I'll be the one to decide when I'm finished with you. Don't ever think that you can...